Gentlemen, it's, it's kind of lonely without Rob and Kelly here. Gentlemen, welcome back to the Tej Hanley starting a business, building a brand blog. This one, you know the number, big number, 39. Good God, a lot has been happening um, since, it, it seems like every day something is happening or something needs to happen or so, it's, it has been an absolute whirlwind. But the good news is that it is or has been exactly one month since we launched. And the day that I'm filming this is the one month anniversary of the Tej Hanley launch. And all in all, it has been just an amazing experience. Um, and things are moving in the right direction. First thing I would like to say is that Rob wanted me to address the email situation because you guys are sending a bunch of emails and we just figured something out yesterday, literally. Um, he had been, the way that he was doing emails, he would get them and as he would answer them, he'd delete them. But there wasn't an acknowledgement when we actually received it that, okay, we got it, just chill for a second, we'll get to you, we promise. And so some people were getting pissed. They're like, yo, you don't care about me. You it's, No, we do. We care about you so much that we're trying to take our time in responding to you. And because it's Rob answering them, each email takes about two to three minutes to actually uh, handle and respond to. And so now what I think we're going to do, and the first business lesson of the day is when you send somebody an email or when somebody sends your business an email it's a really good idea to have at least some type of autoresponder that lets them know hey we received it thank you we'll get back to you and then if you're able to give some type of timeline but it's not necessarily needed um, and so now we're actually going to do that sorry we'll get to you we promise we haven't forgotten about you we've just got a crazy insane amount of emails so be patient sorry about that some other bugs and issues that you may have experienced. Some people are having a tough time actually completing an order. We're working on it. We think we figured it out. And so if you're somebody who has not been able to actually place an order, you put it in the court, cart and then you can't do anything, um, we're working on that and, and that should be fixed momentarily. So give it a try today. It's probably fixed. Um, <laughs> but that's just one of the, the bug issues that, you're, that we are facing with um, the technology and technology is one of those things though there are always things to be done tweaked or changed and really there are some other things that we want changed or tweaked but it's a priority thing and you've really got to determine what is top of the priority chain and then what is kind of the progression downward um, and people not being able to sign up would be priority number one well actually priority number one is website staying alive and we've taken care of that issue um, had a super amazing promotion um, last week. I actually included skincare in the five reasons you're ugly or will be soon video that I posted on the Alpha M YouTube channel. And that was really kind of the first promotion without being like directly like, hey, it's a tease review, come check out. Because that's one of the things that I have learned and this is one of the sort of inside lessons that you're gonna learn. Um, through watching this channel is that people don't or tend not to tune in when they think it is a product specific promotion. And so, you know, if my average video will get say 100,000 views in a 24 hour period after launch, if it's like a promotion and clearly a promotion, it might get half of that, even less. And so it's a much better idea when you're promoting something to integrate it into content that is valuable, that is entertaining. And one of the secrets to my success has been just that. I'm incredibly creative and I work really hard in the way that I actually promote products and, and basically intertwine them into content. And so what happens is when you do that, A, you're gonna get more views and more people are gonna tune in because they're actually thinking they're gonna get value, which they do. And the other thing is, it's a numbers game. The more views you get, the more people are aware of your product, and the more they're actually get. There's somebody hammering. <laughs> Can you hear that hammering? <laughs> Great. Don't mind that. A little construction around the Alpha M headquarters. Um, speaking of headquarters, did you know that Tej Hanley just moved into our very own space? Check it. And this is officially the new home of Tej Hanley. It doesn't look like much right now, but to us, it's absolutely gorgeous.
On one side, we've got our pallets of products. On the other side, we've got sort of our packing stations, and we, we actually put together boxes ahead of time and do all the shipping and, and good stuff right there. Um, but with this next order, that building is go or that room is going to get a lot more crowded a lot faster because we've actually placed our second order ahead of schedule. But let me back up, back to that promotion. <laughs> Sorry, I'm all over the place. There's so much happening. Um, so with that promotion, it was a great thumbnail. And here's another trick to YouTube 101. If you're looking to actually do some type of YouTube video or promotion, or even if it's a advertisement, you need to make sure that the thumbnail and the title are engaging. Um, and that's one of the things that it's taken me like seven years of YouTube to really identify those two things as the most important things about a YouTube video. It's the thumbnail and it's the title. Now, that being said, you need to make sure that the content is solid as well or else people won't watch again. Um, one of the things you hear a lot is clickbait. Oh, it's just clickbait. And there's a lot of it out there. But with my videos, I try to do the most creative, fun video thumbnail I can, title it appropriately, and then produce great content. When I'm promoting a product, I try to integrate it in a fun and informational way. And so I did that with that video, uh, Five Reasons You're Ugly or Will Be Soon, and it exploded. The video was my number one most viewed video in the first 24 hours ever. And it was so exciting. The reason it's so exciting, first off, it's great to break records, your own records, but it's also great when it's about your pro or it's a video promoting your product and talking about your product. And so that has like just, it sent thousands and thousands and thousands of new people to our website. And our website now can handle that. We changed what we needed to do. We had a few crashes early on. Now we're super solid and our traffic um, or our ability to handle large volumes of people during promotional times is, is solid. Uh, but back to our location. So here's the deal. So we move into our location and it's great. It is a, a government sort of subsidized, what Chicago did was incredible. And your location or area may have something similar to this. Atlanta doesn't, <laughs> but Chicago, what they did, the government went in and bought all these old warehouses and factories. They fixed them up and then they started leasing them out to small businesses at a pretty affordable rate. Now, the cool thing is that you do have to apply and you've got to get approved. And so Tish Hanley got approved and so we actually got a space. That is our space. And right now it's great. It looks kind of big, right? We don't have a lot of stuff going on in there other than shipping out products because that's all we do. Uh, but that could change over the year or years. Um, it's also going to look very different when we get our next order. Um, we place the mother of all orders. Um, it is seven times, six to seven times larger than our initial order. And um, that is a result of how, how popular Tij has been, which we can't thank you enough. We can't be any happier. Uh, but we had to place that order quicker than we anticipated, which meant that we needed to come up with money quicker than anticipated. So we've had to get a little bit creative with the way that we're actually going to fund this. The, because when you place large orders like this, generally when you're buying anything, you can get some terms that are going to be like, okay, yeah, we'll let you pay for this in you know, 30 days and 60 days and 90 days. With us and with most people, they're going to want some type of security right away because this uh, situation is we're ordering our packaging first. We need to put down essentially 50% of our packaging for them to even start producing it. And in this volume, in this quantity, that's a lot of money. And, um, and so we, uh, we had to get creative, but I think we actually, we, not I think, we got the funding that we needed. Um, we didn't have to raise capital through like investment. Basically, it's like a loan that you pay interest and you have a certain period of time that you pay it back. And so, you know, that's one of the beautiful things about having the network of friends and family that believe in us. And Kelly has some just amazing relationships with some really successful people that believe in us. They're willing to go out on a limb for four guys with the dream of changing skincare as we know it. Um, speaking of changing, let's talk a little bit about the changes that are going to be coming in this ne next wave of orders. Now, it's going to take a few months for us to get this new 
new order and to sell through our current inventory. And so the changes I'm telling you about right now are going to be happening. They're not going to be happening tomorrow or maybe your next box, but it's coming. So just bear with us, make the adjustments where you need to. But what we are doing is um, we are increasing some of the sizes of the products that we're selling um, or that come in your kit. The wash, we're increasing that by half an ounce. The scrub, we're increasing that by about a quarter of an ounce to make it comparable to the size of the AM and the PM moisturizer. Those two products stay in the same. The pump action products in the eye cream and the super serum, we're actually going to be filling a little bit more because we want you to use a full pump every application for the eyes as well as the serum. It makes instructions a lot easier, plus we just need you to use a little bit more product so that it's the best experience that you possibly can. But right now, stick to the current application process and recommendations. So with our initial sizing, we did the absolute best job we could, um, but we knew that we needed to get it in people's hands and on people's faces before we really locked it down and knew 100% if we got the sizes right. We came close, but you know, it really boils down to usage. You know, if you want to use a little bit more scrub, then you need a little bit more scrub. Uh, but you know, all in all, it's cool. It increased our cost a little bit, but it doesn't matter because it boils down to you having the best experience and us having the best product, the best system on the market, period. So thanks for your input. Now, a few comments about the scent of our products. First thing you need to know, all of our products are fragrance free. And when I say fragrance free, this means that we are not purposely adding additional scents to the products. All right. Um, we're not because the whole fragrance industry, I had no idea until we started doing this is a huge market deciding what products smell like and all that good stuff. Um, is huge business and most companies do scent or, or put extra uh, fragrance in products to make them sp smell like something specific. All of our products are fragrance free but they do smell. Some of them do have scents um, and but these scents are coming from the ingredients, the essential oils, the menthol. Um, so yes some of them do have odor but it's because of the ingredients we're not adding anything extra to make them smell like something that they're not the reason this is important is for people who have sensitive skin um, or some type of sensitivity because a lot of times they will react to the fragrances that are added into products ours some of them don't really smell like anything some smell like something that something is the botanicals and the ingredients that are actually in them so <laughs> like I said lots of stuff going on um, it's been <laughs> it's been quite the experience and uh, it's been awesome so my question to you is, um, what would you like to discuss next week? If you guys have any questions, please, in the comment section, let us know. Um, I do have some things that I would like to talk to you a little bit about next week, um, revolving around marketing and advertising and promotions and things that you can do to really drive home your brand, your product, if you decide to actually start a business or a company. Uh, but I also want to answer your question. So if it's T. Shanley related in the comments, if it's business related in the comments, anything you want to know, we will try to answer. If you're sending us emails, we get it. We're on it. The products, we love it. I hope you, you actually do love it. So thank you. I'm glad you love it. Um, we heard your complaints, your criticisms about the size. We're changing it. The order has been placed. It's going to take a few weeks, possibly a month or two or a box or two before you actually see the change. But we're on it, baby. Just hang with us. And if you haven't tried Tiege, go check it out. Tiege.com. Uh, give it a shot. Like I said, if you haven't tried it, you're missing out. You're going to love our products and they're awesome. We also give you a simplified skincare system, which rocks. Gentlemen, you rock even harder though. Thanks for being a part of this and coming along for the journey.